Greg, a very exciting day for you guys. Have you have announced Josie Altidore? Was this someone who was on your radar for quite some time? Well, yeah. I mean, bringing Josie back initially, we didn't know if it was uh, even a reality. Obviously, we had our three DPS before, but when when things started to trend where uh, Jermaine was going to head out, uh, and the possibility of Josie coming back to the league, this was definitely uh, he was definitely a target of ours. And uh, it's just uh, through the work of a, a lot of people, we were able to get to this point today. He referenced the fact that Michael Bradley played a huge factor in this, and you yourself, being someone who played the game, how crucial is it to have someone with that leadership presence on your team? I think it's great. Obviously, he and Michael have a, a, a wonderful relationship both on and off the field, and uh, I think when you need two designated players that, uh, uh, and then the addition of Gilberto, but your three designated players, if at least two of them have that kind of relationship and, and Gilberto being a great player himself, um, it's the building blocks of, of success. We need our three most important players to complement each other and to work together, and then we can build around that. And clearly, Michael and Josie specifically have that relationship. Uh, they're both hardworking guys that uh, bring the mentality that we want with this team, and um, and they're both looking forward to get out on the field, and, and not just for themselves, but to bring everybody along with them. And uh, that's the mentality of our coaching staff is to work hard and, and to work uh, very smart. And um, these guys have the same mentality, which is why this match makes a lot of sense for us. Well, yesterday, of course, was the Super Draft hosted in Philadelphia. Yeah, and I think you're trying to tell us something. You guys had picked defenders, big guys, and a goalkeeper. So do you yeah. think that that is going to be a transition that comes right into the first team, or is this a USL pro team decision? No, I, I think there are guys in the mix that uh, can compete for roster spots, and, and over time, uh, depending on how quickly they can adapt to the professional game, can hopefully compete for minutes in the first team. But uh, the center back position and the defending position and goalkeeper position is something we wanted to create more depth. Uh, but also creates more competition there. So uh, we did that yesterday very specifically. We had the targets that we wanted to get and uh, um, in no specific order. That all kind of worked out how it did, but we, we got the guys that we were, we were looking for and uh, we came away with a very disciplined draft day that, that really addresses the needs for our club, not just in the short term, but also really in the long term. So now Robin Frazier has also been added to the mix. So is this team finally starting to feel like it's yours? Yeah, we are we're getting there every day, closer and closer. We're really excited to start preseason, but uh, with Robin uh, coming into the staff, we have a, a group that has experience in the league. We have a group that has uh, a lot of knowledge of sort of the game in North America and and, uh, and also guys who will, will debate and, and, and argue and do what we have to do to make sure that we're moving in the right direction. We all have similar philosophies and views on the games, but we all have gotten to this point in different ways. So, um, but we all have a clear vision of what this team um, should look like um, so it's uh, obviously Robin and the players that we're adding is uh, I'm loving the direction that we're going and we we'll look forward to get really getting started on the field.